What is up everybody and welcome to what appears to be my uh, announcement that I am joining the Blue Man Group. I've been trying to figure out the lighting in my new setup for a while now and I've kind of just given up and decided well it's gonna be blue. Why? Because I think it looks okay and it's easy to remember when it's time to game I make my light blue. But you don't care about that. You care about what I think is the ninth installment of three scary games now guys the last few have not been my best work they've been pretty stinky games so i've really really looked this time i've tried to only pick ones that have genuinely good reviews on itch.io not just shit like oh my god greatest game ever by the way please come watch my youtube video and i'll jerk you off no i've looked for stuff that seems genuine and i think i found three that fit the bill and the first one is this game called shadows of timidity i think this is based off the scp 096 but don't quote me on that because I never really was into that shit. So we're just gonna see what happens. Delta 4, you are tasked with securing a highly sensitive entity designated as SCP-096. Gotcha. Maintain constant communication. 10-4. We have lost contact with Alpha Team. They might have encountered some trouble or a signal jam. Try to locate and assist them. Yes, ma'am. Don't forget to switch on your squirrel focus when you approach the entity. When you are close enough, cover its head with the bag. Okay, standard Saturday for me. Proceed with the containment protocol. Stay in touch with the radio constantly. Avoid eye contact with the entity. You're on your own, Delta 4. Good luck. Well, this seems unfair. No, oh, I'm definitely dead. This is the one, like, if, um, you look at him. Alpha team is out of sight. Everything is silent. No gunshots or any other sound. It's freezing here. Moving on. Or, like, think of, oh, wait, hold on. Is this the one, like, if you think of him or, like, see him somehow, he, like, makes a beeline towards you no matter where you are? Well, this guy's dead as fuck. fuck. Oh, no. I found the corpses of some of the Alpha team members. 096 must be close. They must have not been too close, because that was not a very convincing line. Um, is it? Okay, um... Hypothesis trying to grant SCP-096 sentience observation watch of visual stimuli. Okay. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Yeah, I think this is the one... What is fucking shifting in here? Oh, it's the... F it's the air conditioning. I'm so immersed. Um, now what's that back there? Is that him? Oh my god, what the fuck is wrong with you? Holy shit! Dude, these fucking indie game developers and having absolutely no... What? No respect for the fucking ears of their of their player. What am I doing here? Okay, we got a yellow circle in the background. They were trying to make a YouTube thumbnail, I guess. Um, didn't make it past the first step though. Um Have I have I, have I gone the wrong way? I can't go around. This seems like a pretty linear game. Is this fork? Oh, maybe I can go this way. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. We're on- we're on our way. Hey, stop making so much fucking noise, okay? Um... What is that noise? Oh, it's a dog, okay. I've reached the Alpha Team bunker. Checking for any survivors inside. Scramble goggles are malfunctioning too. Continuing the mission. Well, that's bad, right? Because I now I've seen a picture of him. I'm not sure the rules. All right, termination text record. Containment tank containing SCP-096 was placed in SCP-682 cell. Personnel vacated vicinity, and the tank was open remotely. Screams of the two entities continue for 27 hours, at which point the noise abruptly stops. Sonar-based video feed reveal SCP-096 severely wounded and huddled in the southwest corner. Southwest corner. Apparently upset. Feed shows SCP-682 in the north end of the room, approximately 85% of its initial mass absent. 
Recontainment teams retrieve both entities with relative ease. Further attempts to expose SCP-096 to SCP-682 cause it to turn away from 682, jumping in place while clawing at its face and screaming. Interesting. Sorry if my 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 reading skills are a little off right now. Um, I bit the absolute fuck out of my tongue eating, a, 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 like, I guess it was last night at this point. It's it's also three in the morning, which is part of it. Um, I, I literally almost fucking bit my tongue off and my tongue is swollen like to twice its size. Um, it's really bad and I can barely eat. So I'm a little like this. So just bear with me, please. Yeah, it's four in the morning right now. I'm getting my driveway repaved tomorrow. So I'm assuming it's going to be a loud process and I don't think recording during it would, would go well. So we're getting some late night work done. Why did I record during the day, you ask? Well, because I've been grinding fucking RuneScape all day long. New skill came out. So, okay, this is where, this is where I came from. Whoopsies. Um, yeah, new skill came out, if you didn't know. So, you should really get on that if you haven't, if you haven't started. Just FYI. Okay, go this way. And let's see what fresh hell awaits us. Is it snowing? I, okay, I just I just clocked the. Ouchies. I just clocked that it's snowing. Command, I've located a cabin. I'm entering to see if anyone's inside. I hear something too. Okay, can't go in there. That's a fucking. It's like a like a like a like a one to two foot tall figure of a basketball playing rabbit anybody else get in that no okay sorry 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 okay wrong way because i'm fucking stupid yeah that's definitely bugs bunny or something um why okay were we trying to contain him why how did he get out in the first place is my question because it seemed like we had him on lock um well, that's not good. Hey, what are you? What the fuck is that? No, actually, what the fuck is that? Hey, oh, fuck! Shit! Oh, 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 I could have easily just not walked in here. Let it all out, bud. I can't do anything right now. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Um. That was okay, I guess. I mean. It was a voice actor, which was nice. I don't know what just happened there at the end. Uh, maybe I'm missing out on some lore. Um, but, okay, this seems like this was just a giant advertisement for his... Yeah, okay, that's what that was. Okay, all right. I don't know, I'm gonna give that one like a four, maybe a five out of ten. A solid okay. Moving on. All right, so this next one is called Akazu Off Limits. Now, this is one that's been catching my eye for a while now. I just thought it was um, a little bit too short based off what I read for like a whole video on its own. So I'm actually pretty excited to play this one. Um, okay, doggy. Um, hopefully, it's a good one. That's the goal. Okay, don't like that I have to press enter. Studio DYD. So close, it's actually DVD, but... You will get there next time. I found myself lying in a strange place. I had no idea where I was or why I'd come here. The only thing I knew was that I had come looking for something. Dad booty. Okay. Oh my fuck. I have chopsticks for legs. Oh my god, why do I... Why are they... Why can't I see... A, ref a shadow. Okay, no, we're not gonna focus on the bad. Um, it's really hard not to focus on the speed at which I walk, though. This is my thing. Like, 
If I showed this to my mother, who's never played a video game in her life, she'd be like, why is this motherfucker walking so slow? You would think a person who's a, like clearly passionate about games, probably played a lot of games in their life, would know nobody wants to play a game where somebody walks this slow, right? I mean, right? That's like kind of a given, I feel like. This is like a rule of gaming that nobody wants to walk slower than shit. But hey. No big deal. No big deal. Let's let's bring back the pace. You know, smell the roses. It's gonna be okay. This is gonna be a beautiful game. I can I can sense it. Um very windy night, wow. The leaves are rustling, as they say. Um did I start my okay, just making sure I started my audio recording, because that'd be really bad if I didn't. That would not be ideal. Alright. Um, okay, this game is a horror game about having to walk up the longest flight of stairs. Um, this would be a hell of a cardio- Pardon? Oh, my fucking... Cock. Okay. That one gave me a little bit of a shiver. A chill, if you will. Okay, I was- okay, I was about to say. I was making a joke about it being a game about just walking up a staircase, but then I started to kind of convince myself. Let's not do that again. Okay, let's stay out from behind me. I have a gun, and I am not afraid to use it. I don't care how quickly you think you can disappear. I'm gonna fucking blast your ass. Alright, we're in. I'm going to bed. I found shelter from the wind. Let's go to bed, motherfucker. Take my ass to Betty Poom. Okay, I don't like this. I'm just kinda- I'm kinda nervous, guys. Don't know why, nothing's even really happened yet. Um, but I'm a little spooked. Not gonna lie. Uh, there is spookage going on. Okay, we're not gonna go outside right now. Maybe we are. What is this? Got a broom? A broomy roomy? Oh god, this place is- this map is big. Okay. Big, big place to explore, explore for these little legs, but that's okay. I'm from Brooklyn. That's okay. Oh, shit. Okay, this is an interesting little area. Got just... Okay, what? Just a washing machine? No dryer? Okay, fine. Fine. Close line. Close line it up, baby. No judgment here. This is a strange layout, though. Um... I feel like those should go there, but that's fine. No, that's okay. That's fine. Absolutely okay. Um... Nothing in there, it seems. Nothing of interest. We're gonna keep on moving. We're gonna keep it moving and grooving, because that's how I do it around here, baby. I keep it grooving... Sometimes to a dangerous level. The groove I carry, I mean, it's been described as killer. Um, I just noticed my flashlight is slightly off-center, and that's gonna bug me, but that's okay. I'm from Brooklyn. That's okay. You guys really gotta work with me. Like I said, it is four in the morning. So I'm a little I'm a little sleepy, but that's okay. I'm from I can't say it a third time. No, that would be that would be the beating of a dead horse. Um, what the fuck do I do? Is this a walking simulator? I don't want another person to whisper in my ear. That wouldn't be awesome. Okay. Okay, dude. Actually, what the fuck is wrong with you? No, you're so strange. I don't like you, okay? Okay, like, actually, what the fuck is your deal, dude? You heard what I said about the gun, right? Did you think I was joking with you? No? You didn't? Okay, so you want to get shot. That's your thing? I... I mean... That's fine. That's actually okay, though. Um... I do feel slightly disadvantaged though because at okay why 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 are you locked I don't want to I don't want to go back down at the speed this guy's walking um the speed at which I presume he could unholster a firearm yeah he's getting 18 rounds in him before he does anything meaningful um okay so I need a key no I okay I heard a key. But where the fuck is it? 
That's definitely the sound of a key dropping. Um, and that sounded very close. Like, like right in front of me, but I, I didn't see it. I'm assuming it's just... I hear somebody walking and it's not me. I'm almost certain of this. Turn that back on. No. We're gonna leave that on. We're actually gonna leave that illuminated because... I'm a little worried that you guys would get scared if it wasn't. I don't think you guys could handle no light. You know what I mean? And I'm looking out for you guys. That's what I do. That's what I do. I gotta keep you safe on this channel, you know? That's just, that's my job. That's my job. Because, like, when you're on this channel, you're like my child, okay? And I'm here to, I'm here to show you the world through shitty Ichio games. And if you're going to get too spooked, I've got to keep you from that. Believe it or not, that's actually why I play so many dog shit games. Because I don't know what you can handle yet. I'm trying to work you... Work up your tolerance, you know? Okay, no, actually, where the fuck did that key drop? Because it's not anywhere. I don't see it. Was it literally just right in front of me? And I didn't, Oh, no, it's right here. Perfect. Well, I'm sure that has triggered the dude to be in a new location now because that's generally how these games work so let's hopefully not run into him again not his biggest fan i'm truly not like he seems like a nice guy he just disappears whenever i look at him so like maybe he's shy but not the way to make friends dude not the way to make a pal not even slightly i really don't know if i'm like i'm playing tricks on myself or i'm if i'm hearing shit Dude, fuck these fucking footsteps today. Holy shit, they're loud and they're spooky. Okay. Open sesame. Can I go home now? Is he in here? Is he in here? He's definitely in here. He's in this fucking box, isn't he? What do you want? This isn't a good place. No, this is not where I want to be. No. Chill the fuck out. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Okay, what? I fucking hate this game. No, I genuinely hate this game. So bad. Methods of sealing. Place what the shit? Place a sacred paper tag. Two. Place heaping salt on the north front... Ogamon, east, south, back, Ogamon, and west grounds perform Kagura. Shinto music and dance. I'm gonna forget. Okay, sacred paper tag, heaping salt. Got it. No, actually, I'm I'm ready. What is this for? What am I doing? I don't fucking know. I'm sure we'll have that explained to us. I didn't close this door. Oh, the light. Nope. Sure can't. I did not close this door, so is he going to be right here? Mm, right around the corner? No, where are you, dude? Where are you, partner? What is an Ogamon? I feel like I'm at a slight disadvantage. I don't know what the fuck that word means. I don't know what that word means at all. Um, I need salt in a paper tag. You think Walmart sells that shit? Probably, but... Walmarts aren't 24 hours anymore, which is really fucked up. I don't know who who thought they could do that. I need to talk to the Waltons. Um, but they really shouldn't have done that. Where the fuck is the paper tag? Let me call Walmart and see if they're open. Maybe? I don't fucking know. Okay, it's the 3rd of 21st. Um, where's my salt? Honey, what'd you do with my heaping salt? Is it outside? I haven't gone outside yet, really. Looks like something's in here. No? Oh, I can just open that. Oh, that's a loud noise. Holy shit. Okay, let's go explore the outdoors. Coyote Peterson up in this bitch. Um, I thought I could pick that up, but it just shines. Um, Okie dokie. Let's see what's outside. Oh, it's already it's already been going on.
I just deflated your salt, motherfucker. Actually, I stole it. That's really bad. No, okay. I thought, like... No, because, like, deflating a man's salt, that can be forgiven. Taking a man's salt, I'm dead. No, I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked, it's not even funny. What is that noise? It's like, it's part of my walking cycle. You're not, y'all aren't gonna be able to hear this because I turned on the game audio for you. There's like a slight buzz that's part of my walking cycle because when I stop walking, it goes away. It's like every fourth step, it fucking vibrates. What is this? Okay, that's a clothesline, looks like. Um, not important. Let me collect the salt. And ein mare somewhere, probably. Oh, there she blows, and then I need a sacred paper tag. I don't know where that is. Um, do I die now? No. Okay, we're still alive. Perfect, like that. I don't like that those rocks are there, because that means it wants me to walk back this way, so I'm going to see something. I'm going to see something I promise you I don't have any interest in seeing. Like, without a doubt. I'm going to see that fucker who disappears again. I can almost guarantee it. Okay, oh, there's more salt. Wait, did I miss the salt? Did I miss a salt in that corner? I did not look. Hold on. Let me be thorough. Let me be thorough. Don't want to fuck this game up. Was there a little delicious salt? Okay, no, there wasn't. Okay, waste of my fucking time. Holy shit. Told you guys. Told you there was nothing, but no, you insisted. No, you insisted, but hey. At least now you know. At least now you are aware. I don't- I still don't know where the paper tag is. Um, and I gotta find that, I think. I don't really want to walk back upstairs and get jumpy scared. Can I bring a cup of water, maybe? Just for the road? No? Okay, slightly fucked up, not gonna even lie to you. Let me check down here. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Does not appear as I am. Um, okay. Am I undoing your ritual? Has the ritual already been done? Time will tell. Time will surely tell, right? Anything new in these rooms? No. Like, going back upstairs seems like the worst decision I can make. Um, and going back down there seems silly. It always sounds like there's multiple steps of, uh, sets of footsteps. It fucking freaks me out every time. Like, I genuinely hate footsteps. Y'all know this. If you don't know this, okay, welcome. My name is August. I hate footsteps. Feet should never speak. You know what I mean? Feet should be a silent thing. That would be what I ran on for president. That would be my main campaign. I make feet silent. Um, where the fuck is my tag? No, like, actually. What do I do with my tag? Is there nothing in here? Just a spooky little guy? Okay, sure, sure, sure. I guess we'll go back upstairs, unfortunately. I hate upstairs. I hate the upstairs land. Upstairs land makes me pee myself. And piss a little bit. And yes, before you ask, they are two different substances. That mask kind of made me shit my pants. Not gonna lie. Place a sacred paper tag. Place heaping salt. Perform Kagura. Shinto music and dance. Okay, how do I do this? How do I perform such a thing? Okay, there's one, two, three, four, five, six. 
Did I get all of them? Wait. There is one down there. I thought I looked down there, did I not? Because the gate's right there, and it says there's one over there, so... I had to have just missed it. Or is it just talking about this one? No, I think it's just talking about that one. Fuck it, I'll do, I'll do another sweep, I don't know. Because I'm clearly missing something. I've not seen anything I haven't collected yet, so... Not entirely sure what I'm meant to do here. I find it highly unlikely that it would want me to go back down. Uh, but at the same time, I don't really see anything else in the house. I haven't the slightest clue what I'm missing here. Not gonna lie. Because it seems like everything that's interactable, like, pops up. Um, and I'm really not seeing anything I haven't clicked on, you know, locked up tight. Hmm. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay, motherfucker. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Okay. That one should have been obvious. Because it said there was something over here, I should have listened. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Don't be mad at me. Don't kill me. What the fuck was that? No, actually, what the fuck was that? I didn't like that noise. Were those always closed? I don't actually remember. remember. Okay, let's go see if there's anything new. Upstairs. No. I don't want to go down. No, I actually don't want to go down here. Why am I going down? Why am I going- oh, You can still turn around, dude. Oh, it's, it just got so quiet. Oh my god, no. Mm -mm. No, I'm not a fan of this. I I'm no longer a fan of this. This video game. What is this? Is it a tomb? Don't be right fucking behind me. Okay, well, you sort of broke the Im immersion there. Um. Interesting. Okay. That was a solid game. That was a spooky little game. That was got definitely got me on my wiener the entire time. Um, I was a little silly. Wasted a little bit more time than I should have. Um, but no, that was solid. I enjoyed that. That was a good one. I'm glad that one was good because I really have been looking forward to to playing that one. So yeah, solid game. I enjoyed that. We're off to a good start. Let's finish strong, baby. All right, so our third and final game is called Elevated Dread. Now, I think this one is a bit on the longer side, so let's not waste any time. Let's just hop right in, baby. Wow, it's been a long and rough day. You t you're telling me. But finally, this is the last house. I just need to put up remaining flyers on every apartment's door. And that's it. I'll get my first salary. Good for you, buddy. Okay. There's an interesting, like, film effect on my screen, but that's fine. No, that's okay. Handicap it. Hand nope, not even gonna finish that. We're just gonna go. I was gonna say handicap. Accessible. You can enter any three-digit apartment number. I'll let you in. Huh? How does that work? Hello? Oh. 
Whatever, we're in, baby. Oh god, okay, this is not a great... Great looking apartment complex. But hey, I'm not here to live, I'm here to put up flyers, bitch. Oh, a Halloween party. Come and join us for a fun and spectacular Halloween party. October 31st, 123 Anywhere Street, any city- Okay, well... You could have at least tried to uh, make up a fucking address, but hey, no, no biggie. No biggie whatsoever, baby. Okay, this is a... Why is there a bookshelf and two lockers and a chair? Why am I asking questions? That's like I just said, that's not... Why am I in the wall? Holy shit. Like I said, not my problem. Not my... Not my issue. We're here to hang up flyers, not live here. So... Stop... Stop worrying about things. Like, you want to ask, why is there a desk with a water bottle out here? But hey, that's not that's not important. You also want to ask, why is every door different? Why is this one purple? Why is this one wooden? And why are the other ones all this one? But you're not going to ask that, because that's not what this is for. It's not what this is for. Who is paying you to put up Halloween party flyers? Like, who is just paying... Who wants random people at their Halloween party? So the door is locked? Okay. I actually thought that was another apartment complex door. What the fuck? Okay, guess like, guess we're not going that way. Guess we're not headed that way, guess we're going up, baby. Bing bong. Um, floor... Oh, do I actually have to go in order? Holy shit. Probably, right? Kilroy was here, what's up Kilroy? Okay, so we got some interesting pictures of parents and people. Parents and people, wow guys, I need to go to sleep. <laughs> Holy shit. Let me, let me try to walk through the thought process there, okay. So I saw like... What looked like childlike drawing on the wall. So I was like, oh, maybe he's drawing his parent. Why? No fucking idea, I guess because that's just what kids do. So I was like, oh, there's some parents and people on the wall. Parents and people. Not sure where I got the people from. Is there objectively a person? Okay, I don't understand that. Why Why even have that at all? If you're just gonna do that. Like, those are definitely parents and people, right? This, definitely parents and people. Yes, okay. So I, I was right in the, I was right in the beginning. Let's be real. Let's be real. I knew where I was going with that. I knew where I was going with it. Um. Seriously though, back on the topic. Do you just want random fucking people to show up to your Halloween party? Like, would you not just give these to your friends? I don't know, maybe if you're holding like a Halloween bash, but I don't know. That seems like a strange decision. But hey, it's not my Halloween party, so I'm not really worried about it. We'll give whatever is going on over there a minute to settle down. Um, wow. Trash day. Must have missed trash day. Um, wow. It's a woman beating her husband with a frying pan? Not sure. Those are not good drawings of parents and people. That's for sure. That is faux shizzle. Why are... Hey, August. We said we're not going to ask about the doors being different. So you're going to stick... You're going to you're gonna stay true to that, okay? You're going to keep your mouth shut. And you're not going to ask about... Oh, that's an ominous painting. Uh, we're not going to ask about the doors. Because the doors are not important. Oh, wow. Okay, stuff's l much less pleasant on this floor. I don't really appreciate the art as much. Um, that's a person and people getting eaten by a monster of sorts. You see, when your children start drawing things like that, it's it's just time to throw them away. I mean, you can always have another kid, right? That's what they say. Okay. I'm just gonna stop going over there. Because what's the point? Um. What was that? I... I'm not a huge fan of the fact that I saw that and now I can sprint. You know what I mean? I'm really not. I don't love that. I really hate that. Holy fucking cock. Okay, he was trying to finger me. I don't like that. I don't like that. Keep your hands to yourself, bitch. Haven't you learned that? No big deal. Why is there a gravestone in this apartment complex? 
Okay, he fucked shit up on this floor, that's for sure. Um, he even brought gravestones for everybody, which I mean is nice. You know, like, admittedly. These kind of games are my favorite, because the, the concept is so fucking stupid that you can't even question anything else. Like, this kid... Like, I'm, I'm assuming this is a teenager doing this as, like, a, like, an easy job. He has seen a fucking literal creature from another world in this apartment complex. There's clearly... This, this apartment complex looks like a murder scene, but he's not willing to leave. He's gonna hang up every last goddamn flyer he has. Why? Not sure. I guess eight dollars an hour is more important than living to this individual. Um, hey, what can I say? Have I not finished it? I respect the fucking hustle, bro. Oh, whoops. Oh, whoopsies. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Did not mean to fuck up the, the system here. There's a lot of floors. Like, two more than I want to do. If we're being real. At least this one's lit up again. The lights are back on. Um, let's just double check that we can't. Yep, looks like it. Yep, gets a little fuzzy, gets a little hairy. Is this a fucking cleaver? It's four feet tall. What the fuck is this noise? Shut the fuck up. Oh, it's just the light. So we've got a gravestone. Which I guess is supposed to be scary, but it just looks like a shitty Halloween decoration. And then a cleaver fit for a fucking hill giant. As, I mean, what? Hey, August, buddy. I know you're tired, but you've got to remember what the things you're saying. You said you weren't going to question the things you say. You said you were going to put your, keep your head down. And deliver flyers. So, I mean, what you should do is not go in this apartment, right? Well. Why the fuck would I not go in here? That's weird. There seems to be a person here. No. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. I can't go. I can't go. Okay, I can't. You better fucking fuck off, Palski. I'm gonna leave. No, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave right now. Why has every control stopped working? I can't move in a fucking straight line. I'm gonna go. No, that there was nothing for me in that apartment. There was nothing I needed in that apartment. Can we have some roses hanging from the fucking ceiling now? Okay, sure, whatever. No, you want to make it a little romantic? What is this? Babies? No, just big eyeballs. It's going to be a fine I don't like that song. That's ah, not my favorite song ever. Um, okay, we're really starting to rearrange the place. Um, I don't, I don't hate it. It's kind of like an Art Deco thing, like a little bit of, a little bit of spice, you know. Really modernize the place up. I, I enjoy it. No, I seriously enjoy it. Um, is this Kermit the Frog? No, it's a giant... ...flower. I don't even know how my brain inputted... ...Kermit the Frog into anything there. That's... We're, it's not gonna worry, we're not gonna worry about it. We're not gonna worry about it. No, seriously, we're not. Stop worrying, please. Um, okay. Seems like the floors are getting smaller or something. Seriously, really like what you guys have done in the place, but I'm gonna have to be going now to floor 7. Oh, let's see what they've got for me. Hopefully, a new art installation. I nearly shit my pants from a chair. Okay. What did I say about the fucking song? I hate the program, I hate the song. Okay, so I need you to respect that. Nah. That's nothing to, that's nothing to cause any worry about. Pardon? I'm sorry, I couldn't, I couldn't hear that. You don't like the song either? Yeah, I mean, oh, well, okay, we're really starting to get crazy here. 
Um, yeah, it's not my favorite. Oh, wow, shit. Okay. That's some really strong glue. How the fuck do y'all get those things on the wall? Dude, you went into like the trendiest apartment complex in town. They're doing some really cool shit around here. They're really, they're really pushing the boundary here. I, I respect it. I'm psyched for floor eight and nine. Holy shit. About to get wild on this bitch. This one's significantly more boring. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> that bitch is not getting a flyer. He is not invited for sure. There's not a chance in hell I'm inviting that loser. No, seriously. Who are you? No, seriously. No, I mean, why would we go down there? You know? I have a job to do. I've got a job to do. It's called hanging... Mm, okay, well, that seems... Seems like I have only one choice here. Um, let's follow the big, freaky, skinless flesh man. And see what he's up to. Maybe he can be the entertainer for my Halloween party. Magic baby. Okay, sure. No, that's fine. Where the fuck am I? I don't like this floor. No, floor eight's the worst. Okay, floor eight is for sure the worst so far. Um, am I down here? No. Okay, fuck me. No, fuck me, then that's fine. No, just fuck me. That's okay. Um... My brain's not, like, registering things quickly enough to be afraid. Um, that was a fucked up baby. I mean, objectively? A scary baby? Not sure. Um, the skinless flesh man looks a little silly, let's be real. What is this hell? I hate that show. I hate that show. What the fuck? I've got no doors. Can you sh shut the fuck up? I've got no doors to hang my flyers. Hide. Why would I hide? I've got one. Okay, thank God. I was real worried for a second. Why would I need to hide? They say the only thing to fear is fear itself. Correct? So why would I fear... A doorless hallway. I'm leaving the city. I'm going home, fuck boys. Nothing here for me. Who's on a walkie-talkie? I'm going home. I'm getting my fucking salary. I'm making that cheddar. Nothing you can do about it. Hello. We near a train station? This elevator shaft will not be that long. Hey, where'd my fucking elevator go? That's fucked up. And again, no doors to hang my fucking flyers on. Which is infinitely fucked up because if you weren't aware, this is what I live for. I live for flyers. It's what I bleed. It's what I breathe. Can I go down this way finally? Okay, perfect. Why this even needed to be a thing? Hey, why is the baby back? I want my baby back, baby back, baby back. Why is the baby here? Why, like, why did they even feel the need to make this a staticky thing for the first place? Just don't even like have it yet. You know what I mean? Like, don't even... Okay, what is happening? Fuck this game. Okay, shit. We're getting funky. But we're not getting fresh. Which is never how you want to be. Okay, I heard something over here. What the fuck, dude? Chill the fuck out. Let me leave. Spawn an elevator back in my proximity. Immediately. This is fucked up. That was a thing. Dude, you're so fucking ugly, it hurts. He's got a big... A, a big log, though. 
Okay, so we got a dead man, a dead woman, a man who can shapeshift between hanging and skinless flesh man with a sizable penis. Um, and a fucked up elevator that shakes really badly. Can I go home? Who the fuck? Okay, um, that was a loud ending. Not bad. That was, that was pretty good. I, I was getting, I was getting kind of on edge there in the middle. Towards the end, however, I was kind of figuring it out. It wasn't that scary anymore, but a decent little experience that built some good tension and yeah. No real complaints. Guys, I think we've finally had a solid three scary games after a run of many bad ones. These were all pretty good. I really did enjoy all of these. So that's, that's almost a first, I think. I think my favorite one was the second one. I think that one was the most put together, but I really did enjoy them all, which is kind of nice for once. Let me know what you guys thought and let me know what you want to see me play next. But yeah, that's really all I have for you guys today. See ya.